Hey, y'all. I'm Starhawk. And we are back. I don't think I have an audience. We are back with more Valkyria Chronicles. Welcome, Lieutenant Gunther. It warms my heart to see you alive and well. Oh, is that it? It literally just sends you home. Okay. Already on your way back to base? Time is a fickle friend indeed. May your allegiance to Galia stand firm evermore. I was just making sure I hadn't missed one. Missed like a reward or something. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Not like, I don't know. We'll see. I, I always go, come here to look for the orders. I know, like, no orders. I'm just, but I was coming here to look for the orders, which is funny because I never use them, and I really should. I really, really should, <laughs> but I don't. Nothing. No, still nothing. So yeah, I've definitely done all these members. Yeah. Okay. Come back and see the writing on the Okay. So now to the R and D facility. Welkin Fro See what we can get, if anything. Probably nothing because I just did a skirmish and the skirmishes don't really oh, skirmishes do unlock stuff. Wow, those are expensive. I need to be mindful about what um weapon unlocks I get. Like, this is probably worth it. Just because I don't have too many of those super fancy ones. But, like, I don't think the rifles are worth it. I don't think I use anybody. Like, I know the sniper rifles aren't worth it. Obviously, uniforms are always worth it. I mean, I suppose the rifles are worth it. But before I check on rifles, let me check on tank parts. More specifically, more specifically, it's English. Body enhancements, hopefully. Nope, none. Okay. Let's check the shamrock now. Nothing. Wow, nothing. 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 Really? Nothing at all? Well, I guess that the rifle upgrades are totally worth it then. But I'm only going to get the two. Like, like, I, like I've been doing. Wow, that's... Those look really go. cool, actually. Alright. Just gonna double check as I just went through this, but, you know. Yeah, there's nothing else. So, I guess I have that, all that money to, sit, to spend. Um, next time I come. come back. That's nice. Whoa. See if I can get anybody else to 11. Lancers are the only ones that don't have elites. Now, now, now I do. Well, I can't get anybody else to elite, so I'm just going to take... Or I can't get anybody but scouts or engineers. I'm just going to get the scouts up. To 12. You're better than this! Good work! Much like that session... Class up. Congratulations, Lancers! As of today, you are elites! Does that mean anything? Okay, you've earned clearance for a new order. What order? Reducing damage taken from inter enemy interception fire? So that's... Is that fire when... I'm assuming that that's fire when... Come back it's my turn, not sweat. when it's their turn. Um... I guess I could look through the command room and see if there's anybody new, but I don't really think I need new people. Hello, Welkin. Bad pack. Dude, why do you have... Why do you have a carrot in your hair, buddy? Scout killer. This guy might actually be pretty good. But I have good... That's the thing, right? I already have really good... A really good squad. Let's 
need to see if there's a better fatalist. I need to see if there's a better um, engineer. Engineers are awful. All the engineers have such bad... Yeah. All the engineers have such bad... Um... Come back anytime you need to change your lineup, Lieutenant. What are they, personality traits? I guess they're called potentials. But yeah, let me see. I want to see if... Because, like, how many people actually use... So he uses... Oh, he... So Welkin uses the default gun. But I have five of the other guns. Like, yeah. Yeah, people that I actually take have the good guns. So, I don't really know. I guess, um, engineers use... What's the A10? What's the difference here? Oh, this one has more range. Alright. Rand Greaser. It's amusing that the noob tube is called the Rand Greaser. Like, Rand Greaser is the capital city of... I, I get that. I get that. But I wonder. I don't know. Anyway... All right, well, here we go. Into chapter 13 we go. After wresting it from the Empire's control, Squad 7 left Bruel for Nagyar, the stage for this war's grandest battle. Even as they traveled, an increasing number of soldiers streamed into both camps. Both sides braced to feel the brunt of the other's army in the fight for all of Galia. General, as I've said a hundred times now, I strongly recommend a change of tactics. With the disparity in numbers, it's lunacy to send the Galian forces on an all-out attack. We'd stand better chances centered around our defensive holdings, fending off advances. The enemy have gathered in one place for us. We can't let this chance slip by. If we win this one battle, we'll be able to kick those imps out of Galia for good. General, we lack the manpower to break through an enemy force that large. If we're short on soldiers, why aren't you out drafting more farmhands for us? Do you honestly plan to let our countrymen die needlessly out there? When attacked, if not now, Varant, we will win this battle. We must. We'll throw everything Gali has got at them. A few casualties are going to be inevitable. <sighs> if you've got time to sit there fretting, go light a fire under those yokels of yours. Understood. I will do my best. Yay, moronic generals. How come they have the cool generals and our general's the fat dude? Sorry, I'm late. We deploy him? We're still on standby. I'm figuring we'll get the order to move out a bit past noon. Gotcha! Is everybody ready to go? All set and waiting for the word. It sure looks like the enemy's got us in numbers. They do. The invading front's nearly all here. This one's gonna be a major battle. I've made my peace with it and all, but... Seeing them all lined up out there is... Heavy. Guys, can I say something? Um... I grew up in an orphanage. I don't have a family. And I always thought I was alone. But Welkin showed me I was wrong. That I wasn't alone at all. Not anymore. The Sevens are... You guys are my family now. Aw. The squad's your family. Before a big battle like this, it's scary. I figure I feel just like all of you do. But when I think I'm here alongside my family, I feel strong enough to fight. 
family, huh? My old folks are gone, and I got no siblings, but I bet this is what it's like. Of course, any siblings of mine would have grown up a lot better acting than you lot. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds odd to say it, but you're right. And I bet Isar is watching over us all. All right. Let's go do this. Yeah, let's go put holes in those tanks. Yeah, then let's all come back here together. We'll get through this fight and see Galia free again on the other side. I'd say that everybody's going to make it through, but we've already lost one main character. I'd say, you're all fine. You're all main characters. Wait. Wait, that might not be true. Your Grace, all troops have arrived at Nagyar and adopted combat positions. This time we'll crush their feeble army and see your grace to the doorstep of Randgris. Make it so. Silvaria, you have never failed me in your loyalties thus far. I exist because you exist, one aside the other. You go with my trust. Sir, your grace, you are too kind. I was a worthless wretch before you brought me into the light of your grace's company. Estranged from my parents before I could know them. Thrown into that research facility. The object of heinous experiments and deprived of human contact. But your grace took me from that place. Raised me to be a human before Valkyria. Then awaken the powers within you. I betrayed the trust you placed in me. No, Grace. Once I learned that the Valkyria's powers stir only when the body faces death. I didn't hesitate a moment. I would gladly pierce this breast again, even now. When you granted me the shield and the lance from the ruins, I became Valkyria only for you. Never until then, had I thought to feel pride in the Valkyra's blood within me. Now is the time to show the world the power that blood holds. Go forth, Silvaria. Bring victory to my army. Yes, sir. It's funny because the more of the Imperial cutscenes we get, the more I like them. Well, I definitely like their hierarchy more than more than the galleon hierarchy like come on it's not even close At 015. Gallian forces approaching. Approximately two regiments. Silly fools. <laughs> now through the power of the Valkyra. This time we will win. I promise you. It's still interesting to me that the, that was really cool, by the way. It's still interesting to me that the um, Shodan and Nagyar won. What? It's still interesting to me that the game is Valkyria Chronicles and we, and we fight against the Valkyrie. Valkyrie. Anyway. Well, on to the battle we go. Which, no, I said literally last time 
that I was looking at this, I was like, huh, oh, I don't want to be halfway through a battle over the week. I think that I need to get over that and accept the fact that there's always going to be a battle hang. There's always going to be a cliffhanger over the weekend. So, a little bit out of my control. Let's get into it. This is a full-scale showdown against the Empire's entire invasion force. Here are the details. Wow. Okay. Oh, there are trenches. Okay, good. That's something, at least. <laughs> Our soldiers have been working to dig trenches, but the folks upstairs have issued an order for an all-out attack. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, make your way into their trenches. Occupy their base camp, obviously. There's a broad patch. Wide open heavy bombing. Of course they have... Uh... Okay. If you occupy the right camp, you should be able to prevent any more rockets. Oh. You won't have tanks. Once you stop the rockets, the tanks can be deployed. Up then, Until then, it's up to the foot soldiers to take that camp. Oh, boy. Really, I have no idea. Oh, okay. So this is what this defensive structure looks like. Let's get this one set up. And then... Let's do... All right, I have no idea how this it's is going to go. To begin the operation. I ask that you give me 100% on this one. I really should have saved before going into this one, shouldn't I? Okay. So there. Well, here we are, I guess. That enemy camp looks awfully well protected. This one's going to come down to slipping past the enemy fire and into their lines. Lieutenant Gunther, that Valkyria from Barius has been sighted here as well. Oh boy. The Eastern Front is suffering debilitating losses to her as we speak. Are you serious? It's possible she'll head this way before much longer. Keep your eyes open. Of course she will. What? This whole base is under rocket fire? That's the rocket, huh? Wow. I didn't realize that. How am I supposed to... So if they're in the trenches, do they not get hit by that? Is that the idea? I really should have put the sniper over here. Oh, I didn't know. I didn't know. Ready to move out. Have you got visual on the target? Hostile identified. Okay, there's a flag up here. Hostile identified. Enemy sighted. Please maintain focus out there. How do I get out of the trenches? Hostile identified. Question number Enemy one. Sighted. I have to literally <laughs> climb up. Ow. <laughs> Advanced units have engaged the enemy. Support them. Wow, I don't know where she's getting shot from. Work with me here. That'll work. Enemy neutralized. Get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. Everybody be careful. Okay. So I don't know. Make sure to stay. So let's see now what that Oh, there's a scout in mine? Okay, well, I'm gonna take care of him. Leave it all to me! Our hero's in trouble now. <laughs> Charge. You're just not even going to stand a chance here, buddy. <laughs> like, this isn't even a close. Man down. Everybody be careful. Okay. Anything else in here?
So I have to cross that no man's land? That's so nasty. Alright, well, let's get a sniper up. Oh, right. Um, I have a serious consideration that I might just restart this battle. So. Yeah, I think I'm just going to restart this battle next week. I know that that's kind of lame. I don't know. I don't want to lose. Okay, so. That bunker is probably the same as their previous bunkers. So I just got to get behind it. Okay. I really want to get these guys out of here. I mean, I can try. I'll just, I'll just keep going with this. My turn, okay? We'll see. Enemy sighted. How accurate are you for this thing? Oh, that worked. Woof! Last bullet. Okay. Yeah, a sniper up here would be really, really, really good. Have you got visual on the target? A sniper up here with an engineer on this side? Yeah. Charge! Charge! That would be fantastic. So would hopping in those little holes in the middle also work? That's what I need to know. I think that's what I need to know before. That's what I need to know before potentially restarting is... Okay. Try to get that trooper here while I'm here. With Alicia. Tough shots. Let's see. Okay, never mind. Really good shots. Oh, that's what I should do. I should go into that bunker that he was just in. Man down. Everybody if I can careful. get there. And try to find out if this is a safe. If this is safe. Is that guy crouching? I'm gonna keep going with Alicia here. I mean. My turn, okay? Oh, he is crouching. That stinks. I don't know how far this goes. Nope, not not far enough. Good to know. I'm just gathering information right now. Do one more with Leisha. My turn, okay? I'm trying to get rid of somebody. Now. Nice shooting. I mean, she's been shooting really well. I might just be able to push through on this one without the... Alright. Without the, um... Without a sniper in the correct position. But we'll see. Let's see how this goes. Do I lose everybody to, uh... To rocket fire? Okay, cool. So yeah, in the bunkers is fine. Okay, so... I probably just want to run shock troopers across. Well... Oh, man. I can do it without... I can do it this Leave way. It to me. I can do it. There's another one. Whee! Our hero's in trouble now. <laughs> Alright, is he really in trouble? What's up? The bunker is shooting at him. Enemy unit sighted. Be careful, soldiers. I don't know if that necessarily means he's in trouble. Charge! Can you get your grenade up over the hill there? Nope. Okay. Then you're gonna heal yourself and keep going. <laughs> Let's see what Vice can do. Oh, he's obviously out of time. Or out of out of move out of out of movement. I'll take care of it. There's another one. Ha! Enemy Just gotta shoot him back as quickly as we can. Take care of it. 
That guy's not stand not crouching. That's really helpful. Report. What is the enemy up to there? <laughs> nice. While I have mobility points, I need to move, well, I was going to say as close as possible, but I got to be a distance away so that I don't get killed when I kill this bunker. Leave it all to me. Today's the wrong day to mess with me. Ha! Really wish I'd used that super damage for something that wasn't the bunker, but you know. I think he's actually out of the, um... I think he's actually out of the yeah he is nice okay so we're just gonna stop this episode here and keep moving forward next time thanks for watching guys see ya